Have you ever wondered why Linux is considered more secure? In a world where our lives are increasingly digital, security isn't just a luxury, it's a necessity. Whether it's safeguarding your personal data or protecting business information, a secure operating system is key. And when it comes to security, Linux has built a reputation for being one of the most robust and reliable operating systems around. Born from the genius of Linus Torvalds in the early 90s, Linux has evolved into a powerhouse that runs everything from your smartphone to most of the internet. Its open source nature, coupled with an active global community of developers and enthusiasts, has made it a prominent figure in the realm of cybersecurity. But why exactly is Linux so secure? What makes it stand out in a sea of operating systems, and why has it earned the trust of millions worldwide? Well, it's time to unravel the mystery. Let's delve into the reasons why Linux is admired for its security. Firstly, the open source nature of Linux is a major security advantage. This essentially means that the source code for Linux is freely available to everyone. It's like having a recipe that anyone can read, modify, and improve. This openness invites a global community of developers to constantly inspect and enhance the code, creating a sort of crowdsourced security system. Vulnerabilities don't stand a chance in this environment. If a weakness is discovered, it's typically spotted quickly by this worldwide community. And because anyone can propose changes, solutions are not only found but often implemented faster than in closed source systems. This is a stark contrast to proprietary software where the source code is closely guarded, and only a select group of in-house developers can make modifications. This continuous cycle of inspection, enhancement and rapid response to potential vulnerabilities is a key strength of Linux. So, the open source nature of Linux contributes significantly to its robust security. Secondly, Linux's user privilege system provides an extra layer of security. This system is built around the concept of least privilege, which means that a user or process only has access to the resources it needs to perform its function, and no more. Central to this design is the idea that most actions that could potentially harm the system require administrator or root permissions. For instance, if you wanted to install a new piece of software, you'd need to enter your administrator password. This is a safeguard against malicious attacks. If a rogue piece of software tried to install itself without your knowledge, it would be stopped in its tracks because it wouldn't have the necessary permissions. This system also discourages users from running their systems as an administrator, a common practice that can open up a system to more risks. Thus, the user privilege system in Linux adds another layer of protection. Thirdly, Linux is less targeted by malware compared to other operating systems. Now you may wonder, why is that? Well, the answer lies in the user base. Linux compared to other operating systems like Windows or Mac OS has a relatively smaller user base. This makes it a less attractive target for hackers. It's akin to a thief choosing a crowded marketplace over a secluded alley. The potential for a lucrative haul is simply greater where there are more people. But it's not just about the numbers. Linux also boasts an extensive range of security features that make it a tough nut to crack. From built-in firewalls to mandatory access controls, Linux provides a robust line of defense against malware. This combination of a smaller target pool and fortified security measures makes Linux less susceptible to malware attacks. The result? A more secure operating system that's less prone to the headaches and potential dangers of malware. Being less targeted by malware is another factor that makes Linux more secure. Lastly, the regular updates and patches that Linux provides further enhance its security. Now let's take a closer look at how this works. In the world of operating systems, one thing is constant. Change. New threats emerge, old vulnerabilities are exploited and the only way to stay ahead of the game is to keep updating and patching. This is where Linux excels. Linux is not a static system, it's dynamic, evolving and continuously improving thanks to a worldwide community of dedicated developers. These developers, often volunteers, are working day and night, scouring the system for potential vulnerabilities and releasing updates and patches to fix them. These updates are not occasional, they are regular. In fact, Linux distributions typically receive updates multiple times a week. This means within days, sometimes hours of a vulnerability being discovered, a patch is rolled out to address it. And the best part? These updates and patches are not just for the operating system itself. They extend to all the software that's part of the Linux distribution. So, whether it's your web browser, your office suite, or your media player, if there's a vulnerability, it gets patched. But here's the kicker. 
Unlike other operating systems where updates can be a hassle, disrupting your workflow and requiring you to restart your system, Linux makes it seamless. You can install updates without having to stop what you're doing or reboot your computer. And it's not just about fixing vulnerabilities. These updates also bring new features, improvements, and enhancements to the system, making it better with each iteration. This constant vigilance, the dedication to improvement, and the seamless integration of updates are what make Linux such a secure system. It's like having a team of security guards working around the clock to keep your system safe and an army of engineers continuously improving and enhancing your system all rolled into one. Regular updates and patches are the final key to Linux's superior security. To sum it up, Linux's security is attributed to several factors. It's like a fortress built on the solid foundation of its open source nature. This transparency allows for constant scrutiny and improvement by its vast community of users and developers, creating a robust defense against potential threats. Next we have the user privileges system, which acts as a personal bodyguard, making sure no action goes unchecked. By limiting access to its crucial components, Linux ensures that even if a threat does get in, its damage is significantly contained. Moreover, being less targeted by malware is like having an invisibility cloak, making Linux less attractive to cybercriminals. And last but certainly not least, the regular updates and patches are akin to constantly upgrading your fortress's defenses. They are always on the lookout, ready to fix any vulnerabilities that might pop up. And that's why Linux is considered more secure. Thanks for watching and stay secure out there.